My name is Frank and in today's session I will show you how to install Toro Code Studio and run your first transcoding job. After you have downloaded the Toro Code Studio demo version from the mainconcept.com website, you need to unzip the package. As you can see, I've already done this. Now I run the setup file. The welcome screen appears on a screen. The Total Code Studio setup with it will guide you through the installation process. Click Next to proceed. In order to continue with the installation, you need to accept the Euler. Tick the checkbox here and click Install. The actual installation process now starts. It might take a few minutes for the installation to finish. That's it. Total Code Studio is now installed on your system. If it's the first time you've installed Total Code Studio on your system, we suggest to reboot the system. Otherwise, you can also manually reboot later on. Click Finish to end the installation process. Now Total Code Studio is installed on your system. A Total Code Studio shortcut has been created on your desktop. Double click the desktop icon to launch Total Code Studio. There you go. Now I want to show you how to do an easy transcoding job with Total Code Studio. First of all, you need to import a file. Simply go to the Windows Explorer, select the stream and drag and drop it into the input pane of Total Code Studio. There you go. The file is now imported. There is also a second way to import videos into your Total Code Studio application. Right click in the input pane, choose Open Media, and then you can search for the right stream you want to import. Like this. The input section shows a lot of audio and video information of the file you have just imported like the video codec, the telemetry, the resolution and the video bitrate. And also a lot of audio settings like again the audio codec, the sample rate and also the number of channels. If you have chosen a stream for transcoding, simply drag it from the input section into the output section like this. It's now ready for transcoding. Now you are almost done setting up a transcoding job in Total Code Studio. The only thing missing is selecting one of the more than 100 ready to use presets within the application. You get presets for professional camcorders from Sony and Panasonic, presets for adaptive streaming formats like MPEG Dash and Apple HLS, and presets for all sorts of other devices and use cases. For this tutorial we choose a Sony XAVC Long Op preset, like this. Tortcode Studio offers many options to tweak your video, audio, as well as Muxer options. But to keep it simple we leave the settings as is. Now we need to specify an output file name. Go to this button, click it and choose a proper file name TCS Tutorial. There you go. Now we can start the transcoding process by clicking this little triangle here. The progress bar will show the transcoding process. We are almost there. In a few seconds, Total Code Studio will be finished with the transcoding job. Congratulations, you have finished your first transcoding job in Total Code Studio. You can now take a look at the output file in the integrated player. There you go. Your output file looks pretty good. Thanks a lot for joining our first video tutorial on Total Code Studio.